What's going on YouTube? Welcome back to another video. You guys are probably wondering why the Z has the stocks in the front. So around last week, I think it was Thursday of last week, I went to go start my car and I look at my lip and I'm like, damn, the car looked kind of low today, right? <laughs> and then I go check my front tire and it was flat. So I had to take it off and I had to throw on the stocks. I literally cannot even catch a break with this car. It's literally like one thing after another. It's like one week is this, the next other week is this, next month is this. Even my coworker, he was like, bro, it's something new every month. I'm like, yeah, dude, I know. But like things happen, you know, I already got the new tires. Uh, they're at the house right now. I'm just waiting on the day where I can go to the shop and get them put on. I'm supposed to be getting them on tomorrow. Hopefully, fingers crossed, I get to have them installed because riding around with these stocks, Bro, I'm gonna be completely honest. These are probably the ugliest stocks that came on a 350Z. I was unlucky enough to get these stock wheels when I bought my car. They look like Ultima wheels. I'm not even gonna lie. They look like the Nissan Ultima wheels. But um, I've been riding like this for more than a week now. I freaking miss having my complete set of wheels. I bet you people are thinking like, bro, he can only afford the rear wheels <laughs> and not even the front. But hopefully tomorrow that'll change. I'm ready to take more pictures of the Z, post reels and make TikToks and stuff like that. So hopefully tomorrow uh, we finally get that back on and I'm gonna get the car washed and maybe come back here tomorrow and actually take some pictures or like reels. I think this is a pretty, pretty cool spot to get some content. But that's pretty much all I wanted to say as of right now in the beginning of the video just to give you guys a small little update. And also I came here to get a good thumbnail because it's pretty good lighting over here. If I'm able to pull up to the shop tomorrow, I'm definitely gonna pick up the camera and get some content. I'll probably give you guys another POV to the shop. It's back at cam shop again. So you guys already know I like going down taking the trip down there. And before we really get started with today's video, do me a favor, go down below, give the video a like, subscribe to the channel if you're not already, and uh, hopefully I'll see you guys tomorrow. All right guys, it is the next day, and I finally brought out all the tires and my two wheels that were in the front, uh, but I'm kind of in a predicament right now. I don't know how I'm gonna fit all these in the Z, but I'm gonna try and see I think I'm gonna put two up here in the front seat, right? Put those two up there. And then I'm gonna try to do, maybe I should try to take this off and then possibly fit a wheel right here and then put a tire right there somewhere. <laughs> I don't know, I hope this is gonna work. Uh, I think it was this wheel and I woke up and had a flat. You guys see I'm showing like wire right here. Yeah, that's no bueno. And then there's also like little other stuff over here that it could be, but I'm not 100% sure on why it did it but i picked up these tires uh, i always recommended these by a friend supposedly they stretch pretty well and uh, he's had no issues with them so i picked them up and i got a set of two even though the other one was fine if that's going to do that then i might as well just go ahead and replace this tire as well all right i'm gonna go ahead and give this a shot hopefully what i said is gonna work but let me update you guys once i hopefully have all the tires in the z That didn't work <laughs> so i got these two up in the front and those fit pretty fine i got one in the trunk as well but this last tire i have nowhere to put it i was gonna put it probably up here somewhere but i do not want to mess up this fabric up here because it's honestly very clean the headliner has been like that since i got it so i'm trying to keep it that way and uh it's not gonna work <laughs> Now all the effort I put into putting it in there, I gotta take it all out and put it right back up the hill. And I'll probably end up having to take one of them. All right, so we finally got everything put up. I got one tire right here, the wheel right there, and the trunk. A tire here, wheel over there. And let's go. Bro, I'm not even gonna lie. I kind of had faith and having the tires and the wheels in the z i guess in my mind over there by the passenger wherever they put their feet at down there i swear i thought it would be big enough to put the tires at least one tire down there but uh that did not go as planned so 
<laughs> this is the first video of 2024 and I just want to say Happy New Year's to you guys. I appreciate all the support from last year. If you guys ever bought anything from Forever or even like like any of the videos or subscribe to the channel, whatever. Thank you so much. I do have some other small things coming for Forever and uh, I'm getting that made right now. So that should be coming up soon. And sadly, I couldn't take the Z. You guys know I like going down this one part of the road going to the shop where it's like the lake view and stuff like that. I'll, I'll definitely take this. <laughs> it's definitely not as fun to drive as the Z, but it's definitely more comfortable um, and definitely more spacious and whatnot. And we're honestly not too far from the shop. So whenever we get there, I'm gonna chop it up with Cam, tell him what's going on and I'll see you guys in a bit. And just like that, we are back with some fresh meat on these tires. I went ahead and got the car jacked up in the air so that I can just swap out the wheels real quick. I finally get to get rid of these freaking stocks. See, I'm glad that I kept them, you know, for situations like this. But dog, that just looks goofy. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie though, I'm out of breath. But getting this car up in the driveway and then getting it up on the jack stands, it is so complicated and such a headache to do it but it is what it is at the end of the day i even told myself i even told you guys i was like bro i do not want to work on the car but the flat tire happened out of nowhere it's nothing you can do i really didn't want to work on the car because it is a little bit chilly outside but it's not too bad right now and i'm also going to be addressing this issue where these freaking side splitters are just like flopping everywhere i need to tighten the screws or something i do plan on getting these repainted because they are very very sun faded and this is one part of the car that i don't like at the moment i'm gonna get these repainted probably sometime next month and i forgot to mention i'm also going to be putting on this plastic for the passenger wheel well it ripped out one day when i was going to charlotte and uh, i had to yank it out because it was dragging all over the highway i think that's why they're starting to get some condensation in the headlights because when it rains it just splashes all up in there i'm gonna go ahead and try to install this as well so we don't run into that issue anymore all right i'm gonna go ahead and knock this out and i'm gonna show you guys how it looks afterwards i'll see you boys in a few and just like that guys the z finally has the new tires on and it honestly looks a thousand times better i could not stand the way it looked with the oem wheel on i've been trying to make this video for you guys for like the past week and it's just been like freezing cold it's been raining the weather just not been it it's just a lot of stuff going on but i finally got it all put together now and it looks way better than it did before and i just spent the last like 30 minutes on that side right there getting some pictures took some videos for instagram and tiktok i know i haven't really been doing too much to the z besides the engine swab since then i haven't really touched the car but I do have a surprise coming next week and I'm definitely gonna make a video on that. I think you guys will like it a lot. It's coming Monday, it's gonna be sick and I hope you guys are ready to see it. I'm ready to see it. I'm not gonna lie, sometimes I come out from work or like look at the car, sometimes I'm like, damn, this car came a long way. Like it's not exactly where I want it to be, but for right now, dog, this car looks so sick. I know my headlight has a little bit of condensation inside, but it's cause it's raining. It was not, you know, whenever it's warmer, it always goes away. I was so close to buying some new wheels uh, a couple days ago, but as soon as I went to go add it to my cart, it said it was sold out. Bro, I was so pissed. But at least I was still able to cop something else for the car and I'll be able to make content for you guys and whatnot. But the tandems still go hard, not gonna lie. I do love the tandems, but I just had them for a long time and I'm ready to switch it up a little bit. I've been talking about chrome wheels for the longest time. And I feel like with the way the car looks right now, some chrome wheels would go crazy. I already know what set I want to get. I'm just waiting for them to be available. Once I get some chrome wheels, I think I might just get rid of these or i could keep them as spares it depends or i can just keep them and get them polished some chrome tanners will go stupid i've been talking about that for a long time i don't know if i'm gonna do it or not but i'm not gonna lie though this spot is crazy to get some content and the lighting is super good it's in a parking deck and the whole setup is pretty sick with that being said i'm probably going to end the video with some cinematics but uh whenever my new part gets here I'm definitely gonna pick up the camera, show you guys, and make a video on that. And I hope y'all enjoyed today's video, man. If you guys did, go down below. Like the video for me. Subscribe to the channel if you're not already. And I hope you guys enjoy the cinematics.
time.